Hello everybody, it's your girl Ghost Bunny, and today I thought I'd try something new and play some Sims 4 for you guys, and uh, one, I haven't played it in a while, two, I'd like to try out this new thing I thought about where I went on to Google, and I used a random phrase generator where I would count up to ten different times to randomly generate a phrase, and it ended up coming out to being um, on the same page, which means thinking alike or understanding something in a similar way with others. So that's what we're going to do for our theme for this episode. And right now what I'm going to do is just not really in specific customize a character. I don't want to waste too much time doing that. But what we're going to do instead is basically randomly generate everything until it sounds good. We'll give her, we'll give her the same exact name, mm -hmm. kind of, but the girl version. His name's Marcello, hers would be Marcella. <laughs> Funny, haha, <laughs> creative. Oh. And so what we're trying to do is get these two to be oh, almost so. exactly the same, but also each of them have Ooh. a successful life. That would be really good, because then um, we gotta try and basically clone as many people as much at the same time. Okay, uh, let's say... So that they're kind of the same, but also completely different. And from there, we'll be able to see how much they're different, how much they're the same. Let's get into it. Oh my goodness, it's so weird. We should go... They seem like very busy people, so we'll put them into our more busier town. And find them an apartment they can share. Because twins gotta stick together. They don't have enough money for any of this, I don't think. Oh, they do. Okay. Unfurnished. Furnished. Oh yeah, they're saved tons of more money if it's unfurnished. Um, let's go. And here we are. Home sweet home. Uh, let's see. I feel like... Oh, so this is the bedroom? Oh, they got a little patio. That's pretty cool. I never had a room with a patio. Um, I'm guessing this is the walkway. Here's the kitchen. Okay, uh, I'm gonna do a quick little speed build, and from here, we'll see how we go. <laughs> to hold someone to care someone who's there I try to find someone who's me and knows how I be cause take it from me I don't wanna be Looking for someone to hold, someone to care, someone who's there. I try to find someone who's me, knows how I be, cause take it from me, I don't know. There you have it. 
this is now their new homes. Uh, Marcello and Marcella are now going to be living here for the rest of their lives. Doesn't have a lot, you know, literally only have a bed and a lamp in each room and a small living room and their, their little kitchen area. But you got to admit, when you first move out, you don't have a lot. And what, what you really spend all your money on is just moving in most of the time so we're just gonna move on in and have them get jobs because they don't have a lot of money to do really anything so I'm trying to get them a job each of them need to get a job because you gotta be equal in all of this and here they go they're gonna go find themselves a job I'm not sure what each of them want to do um, he's a book reader and she's a music lover so I might have to do something that relates to both of those um, she likes music, so, uh, let's make her do an entertainer, because she'll have to do a lot of music and things like that, so that'll help. And he likes reading, so he'll most likely have to be a writer, because writers do a lot of reading and typing, I th think. Yeah, let's do that, that's fine. Awesome, now they both got jobs, and that's clear one. Um, next thing on the list is not only to get them a house, but to get them a bunch of friends. Um, do they do the welcome home thing? Uh, I need to get them to eat, because I know they have to eat. Well, not yet, but uh, they both gotta eat anyways. Uh, so let's have him cook something. Yeah, let's get some grilled cheeses. I want them to be party sized so that they'll have plenty of food. And what she'll do is... I didn't get her any books, did I? I didn't put any books in for her. Oh no, she's a music lover. Okay, so she'll... What am I going to do to get her music level up? Mmm, we're going to have to go buy something. Okay, so I spent a little bit of money, bought her a guitar so that she can play that in order to get her music level up. And as an equal, I got Marcelo some books so that he can get his reading level up as well. So I'm going to have her practice her music. And he's going to cook their so-called breakfast, I guess, because it is only 8.20 something in the morning. He seems pretty happy to be able to cook though. Read something. Just read anything. Anything to get your reading level up. But what job do you have again? Oh, you're a writer, so you need to learn to write. I need to get a computer. Oh, I can't. I have to keep buying stuff. Okay, we're back. So I bought him the bare minimum so that he can afford a computer. And that was pretty horrible. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, it's a welcome wagon. Whoa, where do all these people come from? Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, are you part of the welcome wagon? Yeah, go ahead. Come on in, everybody. Come on in. Yeah, sorry, guys. We don't have much. Oh, Marcel! You're supposed to put your stuff away. There's a lot of chatting going on. <laughs> she's only talking to him and then there's this lady who's sitting in her bedroom and eating grilled cheese that Marcella made that's not fair he made that for, for them and someone brought us fruit cake yay I'll just put that in the fridge and forget about that Looks good. Looks good all good. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, who's angry? Why is she angry? What? What did they do? No, why did you make her angry? What is wrong with you? Oh man, I gotta fix this. Try to calm down. Brighton Day. Do everything you can to make her feel better. Oh, this is your oh, fault, Marcello. That's what you get for trying to flirt. And then she's and then he's embarrassed. You okay? Yeah. 
Why is he embarrassed? What? What did you do? What have you guys done? This has gone downhill very quickly. Oh, she's hot-headed, that's why. Okay. Oh no, he said no! Things are going so well. Oh no. She does not like him. Oh yeah, you skip at the boy. Don't you insult her. Why are you being so mean? <laughs> Say you're sorry. Um, apologize, yes. And make her feel better. You shouldn't have gotten her so upset. You missed your chance, Marcelo. Why did you do that? You could have made a good friend, but instead you're done and messed yourself. Okay then, so that little community get together did not go too well. He lost his prospective girlfriend and she actually did pretty well, but she was a little embarrassed for some reason because I guess I don't know what happened with Arun. They're married. Oh no, I tried to do something bad. Oh no. Okay, well, obviously now we know that they're off the the menu, and so we have to actually go out and find- So who the heck do you think you are? I'm gonna go find them a boyfriend-girlfriend somewhere else. Um, we can come on down here and see if we can find somebody. Oh, he seems like a prospective dude for you. This dude. Young adult. Yeah, so... Let's go meet him after you're done eating, and then for you, let's see, is there any females around? What is that? What is this? <laughs> nope, not going over there.